Every mob in Minecraft has a weakness. Yes, even chickens. So today, we'll be covering every mob's weakness in Minecraft. So first off, let's start out with us, the player. And all Minecraft players have only one official weakness in the game. And that is the creeper, because funny enough, the creeper is the only mob that only attacks us. This guy attacks not pigs, not cows, not zombies, only players. And as you can see, it's a pretty common occurrence. Number two, we are talking about zombies. Now, obviously, their main weakness is the sun. They burn in daylight. But zombies also, ironically, have a weakness of water. If you can get a zombie underwater, they are really slow under here. So most likely, they will drown and turn into a drowned mob. Just like this guy right here. Number three is the skeleton and his ugly cousin, the stray. As you can see, a big weakness for them is also the sun. Hence why they're in shade right now. But even in shade, they are also afraid of wolves. Wolves like bones, skeletons are bones, wolves like skeletons. The circle of life. As you can see, it didn't end well for the skeleton. Number four is a funny one. We're talking about the big deadly Ravenger. Now this guy looks unstoppable. He has no weakness, right? Wrong. This guy hates sweet berry bushes. Now when I say hate, he's not gonna run away from it. He's not like afraid of it. But if he gets stuck in this thing, he takes damage and he will not get out of it. Look at this guy. So silly. Oh, he got out of it. Okay, the idea is to surround him in berry bushes. Because if you make a box like this, he is not getting out. He will do everything he can to avoid the berries, but he will eventually die in here. Hence why this guy's weakness is fruit. That's kind of funny. Number five, as we fly into the jungle, we are talking about the precious panda bear. Not you, you're ugly. But panda bears actually have a really unique weakness that's kind of sad, but it's also pretty cool. Some pandas, like this guy right here, will be afraid of thunderstorms. And they'll be so afraid that they can actually take damage. Their anxiety is so crippling that they will hide their face and rock like a baby. <laughs> And if we're lucky, we'll see him take damage. That sounds morbid. I feel so bad for this guy. Okay, it hasn't happened yet, so I assume it's a rare occurrence. I actually haven't seen it myself. But the Minecraft wiki does say that it happened, so I believe Minecraft. For number six, let's stay in the jungle and find some parrots. Excellent timing. Parrots' weakness are cookies. If you didn't know, if you feed a parrot a cookie, he will get murdered. I thought it'd take more time than that. That was so fast. Wait, are they all that fast? Oh my god, it's a one hit! If you want to PvP some parrots, I got a trick for you. For number seven, we're talking about drowned, and I'll make it quick. Obviously, drowned is like the water version of a zombie. So, the inverse of water is air. Drowned don't like air. Especially babies. Babies hate air. New parents, don't listen to me. Real babies love air. Number eight, creepers are afraid of cats. This is a pretty common thing to know because you can actually make a creeper farm using cats if you kind of funnel the creepers into like a kill chamber. So very useful thing to know. But yes, creepers and cats do not mix. Number nine, endermen hate water. If I push this guy into water, he will freak out. Oh, 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 he, oh, 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 what a move. You're still gonna get wet, dude. There we go. He hates water. He teleports out. Also, if it rains, that will also affect him. Now for number 10, we're talking about turtles, but not just the big boys like this, the baby turtles. The big guys are totally safe. No weakness, very well-rounded mob. But the babies are a great snack for cats, foxes, and ocelots. I hate to show this off on video, but you're gonna see it. If I gotta see it, you gotta see it. Guys, I'm so sorry. Go, dude, go. Run away. Yes! Freedom! Number 11 is fairly obvious, and that is that villagers are afraid of zombies. Zombies will try and eat them and turn them into a zombie villager. And following suit, number 12 is about the zombie villager. His weakness is ironically a weakness potion and a golden apple. If you feed him those two things, he will then get cured into a normal villager once again. Number 13, iron golems. Normally, they just go and fight mobs and they're totally strong and amazing. But if that golem goes underwater, he cannot swim. He'll be stuck, he'll sink, and bye-bye golem. He's going for the 360 no scope. And if you want to see this live in action, here's my own survival world. I swim down here to the bottom of my ocean and there's golems down here. Because once they get down here, they're not getting back up. For number 14, we're talking about slimes. Now, slimes are normally found in caves with lava in it, so I would say lava is the slime's weakness. You could argue iron golems might attack these guys, which they can, but more than likely, slimes will die on their own if they fall into lava. As you can see, these guys aren't really smart. They really aren't that smart. Number 15 is the blaze, and the blaze are extremely allergic to snowballs. They don't like these things at all. They also hate water, but in the nether, you can't really get water in here, so snowballs is my choice. Number 
16, piglins are afraid of soul fire campfires, lamps, and torches. I don't know why, but it freaks them out and they run away. Number 17, hoglins hate warped fungi. As you can see, they book it out of there. Next up, wither skeletons really hate healthy potions like regen or strength. For them, it gives them damage. At least, it should. Let's try instant health. There we go. Okay, they don't like instant health potions. And number 19, striders don't like water. If they're in water, they will take damage and die, but it's hard to show that in the nether, but take my word for it. I've never been wrong before. Number 20 is a really helpful one, and that is phantoms, and their weakness are cats. So kind of like creepers, cats really scare off phantoms. This guy is just freaking out, going in circles for some reason. An odd way to cope for sure, but it works. Number 21 is interesting. We're talking about spiders. During nighttime, they're very aggressive, but in the daytime, even in survival mode, they will not attack you. So their strange weakness is the sun. Not in like a burning way, in just a cool way. Number 22, I don't actually believe it, so I'm gonna test it right now. Apparently, wolves are arch enemies of llamas, so... Oh, he's afraid. Okay, wolves' weakness is llamas. That is news to me. Oh, he hates them. Oh my god, that's so mean. They're gonna actually attack him too? I don't like that, Minecraft. I don't like this at all. Number 23, the weakness of a cat is a player. Players will run away from you and avoid you at all costs and even go near cacti. So if you try to tame a cat, you'll probably know this pain all too well. They run away from you so much. It's a similar story for rabbits as well, but in addition to players, it's also cats and dogs. The dog will chase the rabbit Oh, he's mad. But yeah, these rabbits, they, uh, they are in danger. They are definitely in a lot of danger. And I'm sure me spawning dogs is not helping his cause. And for number 25, very similar story. Chickens have a weakness of cats and dogs. They will both try and murder the chicken. This one is super well known, but the weakness of a sheep is a wolf. As stated right here. Number 27 is about bees, and it's really dumb. Bees will try and pollinate wither roses, which will in turn kill them. Look at him, he wants the flower, he wants it. Oh, you're so dumb. And he'll do it over and over and over and over. Number 28, we're talking about bats. Now bats are just like slimes in the sense that they will just go into lava because they're dumb. They're getting pretty close right now. There's no mob that actively tries to kill them, but they just kill themselves. The enemy of the fox is the wolf. Wolves hate a lot of things. It's kind of funny. But yeah, they'll actively try and kill foxes, but they never catch them because they're so fast. Now for the next four, I'll save you the trouble. They're all fish or mammals, things in the water that don't like air. So fish hate air, dolphins hate air, squid hate air, even guardians hate air. But let's spice it up for number 34. Shulkers actually hate water. If they go in water, they teleport. But I don't believe they actually take damage in water. I haven't seen it yet. I guess we'll find out. Not nothing. They're just, they're just great at what they do. Very efficient. Good job, boys. Number 35 is very unique. Endermites. This is news to me, but they actually die if they stand on soul sand for too long. So if they somehow get trapped in a little box of soul sand, they will die. I will wait and prove it. This is taking a while. Well, as I wait for him, I'll go do my last one. For number 36, snow golems will always die in hot climates like the desert. So guys, those are all the known mob weaknesses in Minecraft. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned something new. But most importantly, did the guy die yet? He didn't. I am confused, but impatient. So I'm gonna leave. Hopefully I'm right on that. That one might be incorrect. I don't know. If you want to see more content like this, make sure to like, subscribe, do all the good stuff. And I'll talk to you guys next time. So until then, goodbye.